Hi, my name is Prakash Patel and you are watching all about importexport.com. In this video, I would like to show you how to use uh, Google language tools to overcome the language barriers with foreign prospects. The fact is, most of the people dealing with foreign prospects are very frustrated with language barriers when they have to communicate with foreign prospects. So in this video, I will exactly show you what is Google language tools why you need that tool and how to use that tool to overcome the barrier of foreign language. So I'll see you on the other side. Hi, welcome back. Uh, this is the main, main uh, page for Google language tools, but uh, let me show you, you can go to google.com and this is a Google main page where either you can select this language tools uh, selection here to go to the Google language uh, tool page or you can even search here Google right there the first one is right there as soon as you say Google language and it comes right here it's the same page and it's basically a three area where you can have a, a translated search here suppose if you know some specific word or specific phrase in uh, Spanish or any other language you can type in here it automatically understand that word and then you select your language which is let's say English uh, and you say translate search and it will go ahead and uh, search those uh, word in uh, websites web pages into that language and translate into the English sometimes it's very helpful the most important section is here where it says translate text where basically uh, it allows you to or cut and paste any text in any language and then you can select that language uh, which is which you don't understand and then you want to translate your language which is let's say for example English and then once you click it it will translate that uh, text into whatever the language in this case is Spanish if I cut and paste uh, a paragraph of Spanish which I don't understand I can convert into English by clicking this button and the last section here says translate a web page. So if I know a website, let's say in this case maybe English and I'm a Spanish guy and I want to convert it, I can pick and choose here uh, the website here. Uh, let's say it's in English and uh, I want to get that into Spanish because I understand Spanish for example and then I can give a website all about import export.com that's my website in English but let's say one of my viewer wants to convert that into Spanish as soon as they type in the website address and if they select that this website is in English but they want to convert into Spanish and say translate I will go to the website and it will pretty much translate this into the Spanish wherever uh, the, the texts are there. Yeah. So the graphics image, it may not convert, but other than that, all the text are now into uh, the Spanish. So you can see all the text are converted into Spanish. Even in uh, the pop-up windows like this convert into Spanish too. But as long as it's in the text format or HTML has a text in it, are able to convert but some of the graphics image won't be able to convert this is a graphic image a flash image so it won't convert but other than that it will get you uh, the Spanish uh, wording here so you can read those into Spanish here all those things the sidebar also in uh, Spanish as long as it's not a graphics so it's a pretty good feature for people who don't understand that native language uh, and they have different language they can definitely use these features I can go back here and that's uh, the last section I covered. Now I can give you an example. One of my uh, client one time sent me an email and I can show you exactly the example. In my contact form on my website, uh, they wanted some inquiry for the product, but uh, they sent me in Portuguese here because I know their countries and everything, but I don't understand the Portuguese language. So I copy those text and I said I don't understand Portuguese but I have the 
uh, Google Language Translate tool here. So I paste here, and if I select, let's say, Portuguese, right here, Portuguese. Now I want to convert into English. If I click here, Translate, right there, it will say, uh, here is the Portuguese version of the text, and here on the bottom it converts into English. What they wanted to do is, uh, I'm looking for a Sony VO CS160A, want to know if you have and how much. So basically they wanted to buy a, a Sony, uh, some kind of a special model uh, flat screen TV or something. So. That's what they wanted, but I didn't know that. So this definitely helps in businesses like import, export, where you're dealing with your clients and clients sending you either the size Skype text or maybe uh, email message or some other text, which in their language and you don't know that and you want to find out what they're looking for, you can come here and cut and paste and translate. Even you could, uh, technically have your language stuff here and translate into the your client language and if you don't know how to speak up you can even use this button where it will pretty much try to speak out let me try this i'm looking for a sony vio cs 160a want to know if you have and how much so that's another good way of uh, converting uh, uh, the text into the audio and you can uh, relay that audio to your clients so they can understand their language. So it's a pretty good tool to convert from one language to another language in text or maybe you can convert that uh, into the audio format. So that's how it works. And on the top one is basically you can type in any uh, sentence something like that I'm not uh, someone something like that let's say automatic language and if you, my language is English if I click here uh, it will say gracias means thanks in Spanish and it turns out here in English all the websites uh, where you could pretty much uh, do all this uh, let me open up the third one and it will translate into maybe English so and Spanish. So uh, this is where you can even read those stuff in English uh, because my language is English. I, I try type in a search phrase or search word into let's say Spanish and now it converts into the English which I can understand that website. Otherwise, if I go to the Spanish version, I may not understand. So that's a very good feature too, but sometimes very helpful. But basically, most of the time, you will end up in having some kind of a text message or a email message or some kind of a website you are reviewing where there is no translation tool and you want to find out what their web page is saying. You can cut and paste uh, their uh, text in their language here and select the appropriate language it is, maybe Chinese or maybe Spanish or Portuguese, and your language may be English or some other language, and you can translate it and understand exactly what that text or web page or content is saying. So it's a very good feature to help you out, and you can reverse that process and send them back uh, the information, uh, which is very helpful for them to understand. So this tool definitely helps you. I hope you like this video. Thank you for watching. Before I end this video, I would like to thank you for your time. If you like this video, please visit our blog site www.allaboutimportexport.com and sign up your name and email address and I will send you several technology roadmap videos just like this absolutely free. Thank you.